vibes like where am i doing this am i 10 years old ah, it's scandalous guys it's scandalous like good for twerking <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Naninga Kwe and I love thrifting. So basically this is a thrift haul as usual. Too much, too much. Maybe if you follow me, you know that it's too much, but hey, it keeps me fit. It keeps me energetic and yeah, let's just get into the video and it prevents me from looking from, for content for you guys the easiest content ever so you guys just say that it's not easy but let's just get into this so here is our bag that i normally carry stuff in you know this bag if you're not new to this channel you definitely know this bag so let's just get into this video the first thing that i got this time around was jewelry guys i got jewelry yes i even threw the jewelry in this bag but i thrifted jewelry and i thrifted a jewelry set so then jewelry set looks like this as you can see there it has the like nine dollar tag but you know get you guys i love jewelry so it's a set actually but i didn't like the earrings i wish they were like for holes because the earrings are like clip on so i guess it's like an old school set so the earrings are love hearts like this hope you can see the love hearts they are love hearts and the chain is also a heart the first time i got it i, I was so excited i actually didn't even bother to check i actually thought like this thing is a locket like it can open because you see the way it's round so I thought it could open and that's actually the reason that I bought this set. But either way, I bought it at a really, really affordable price and it's so pretty as you can see. You're just going to see it in my other videos. So I thrifted this jewelry set and I'm so glad I got it because where am I going to get this honestly? So yeah, the seller sold it for me at 400 bob. Yes, I know that's costly for thrifting, but she sells jewelry and she claims that they are expensive. So painful for those of you who follow me you know that i could never buy <laughs> so painful if you're used to buying 30 shillings things and then buying jewelry that is second hand at 400 bob but i guess it is worth it after all these earrings i got them from aliexpress and they were not even 400 bob you can imagine if you haven't watched my aliexpress haul go check it out i bought some amazing stuff this is one of them as you can see it's so shiny and blingy and yeah let's just get to proceed with the haul i got a bunch of socks i know this haul is going to be here and there but i go i found this seller who had just opened a bill of socks <laughs> and i didn't have this like type of short socks long ones that are cotton and i thought that they'd be really fun to wear with sneakers and not be visible and they have like a certain thingy right there let me just switch off this light so that you can see this thingy this glue like this glue they have glue on them at the back it's not glue it's like stickers so that they don't um yeah what is it called so that they don't slip off your foot and they're made of cotton so that was the best part about them they're actually made of cotton as you know mutumba things you know those people love themselves in those countries eh? not like us we just wear nylon on our feet and walk around eh? but <laughs> so i bought three pairs of these ones and i bought like some midi ones they're like not that short as short as these ones and also they were large to fit my large feet for those of you who know i'll keep on singing how tall i am and my feet are large so yeah four pairs of socks and this jewelry set it was a win guys it was a win and then the next thing i got is something that <laughs> this is not designer guys do not be fooled by the old fendi logo i suspect that this was uh, a knockoff yeah because it doesn't have any telltales of a fendi so it's just a hoodie 
that is yellow and white and i thought yellow you know african skin looks so good with yellow just look at that and it has white sleeves the quality is really good though and it's a hoodie and it's a cropped hoodie so i got that that was really cheap i think like 50 bob yes i got it for 50 kenya shillings and this is my favorite 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 thing because i got this at 50 bob and it's just written love to shop yeah it's written love to shop with somebody carrying bags and so many love hearts so this is just a t-shirt i know it's an extra 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 large because it says size 20 to 22 but i'll just wear it i don't i don't care even if it's for a size 25 so it is written love to shop and i got that at uh, can i remember i bought these things like quite a while back like two weeks ago no one week ago god i've done so many hauls i've forgotten like exactly how much i bought that one for but i'll try and remember then i got this tie dye i like simple now nowadays i'm going for simplicity i know tie dye is not that simple but it's kind of simple and tie dye is in so i got this t-shirt it's a t-shirt a fitted t-shirt like and it just has like a raw hem and yeah it's cute that one i got that t-shirt i think i got it at 50 kenya shillings yeah that one was 50 definitely i can remember that t-shirt was 50 uh so was this black t-shirt this black t-shirt just plain black the previous haul that i did for clothing i think i had a plain white t-shirt so when i saw a plain black one i was like i need that i actually do not have any plain black t-shirt i have spaghetti straps i have fancy designs but i don't have a plain black t-shirt so i decided to get one and then i also got um a weird dress now that i look at it it's like a tennis dress but it just has love heart buttons i guess that's what attracted me to it if you haven't seen already i like love hearts and so pretty it's just green looks like a tennis dress but it's just simple nice and also oh okay this haul was kind of here and there this sweater thing i found a seller who was just selling like so many sweaters and sweater dresses so i was just like let me take it and i think it was 50 kenya shillings this one this one was 50 bob this green one was 30 bob it was in a pile of 30 bob dresses and then this one was like in 50 bob dresses it's just fitted and it's a dress actually like a sweater dress like those light sweater dresses and it's striped and it has shimmers in it and then there was also another one this one was like my favorite i hope it will fit i just kept these things up for a corner they hit the way i hope it will really really fit it has a slit at the front it's also a sweater dress i bought it together with this one from the same seller it's just the sweater dress is it's v-neck long sleeved and it's super stretchy so it looks thin it looks like it's really really thin so i don't know how that's gonna work then next we have this top oh this one i loved this one i got it at 30 kenya shillings but it looks so nice and so simple and so pretty and just has a tie at the back and it's cropped it's going to see it and then this one Okay, I've even forgotten these things that I bought. <laughs> no, I'm looking at them like, did I did I really buy this? Like, how did this end up in here? So I bought these two from the same seller. This was 30 bob also. It's a black cropped top and it has a band. If you can see, it has a band at the bottom. This is a band at the bottom and the back is v-neck like that. This is the back part. This is the front and it's lace yeah so it's pretty so sunny bob goodness <laughs> i have a problem <laughs> with this kind of print i honestly do have a problem with this kind of print i got a leopard skirt i actually don't have surprisingly a leopard skirt so i was like let me get one i really i'm wondering because i think i kept these things in that bag for too long like i never even checked them after i bought them so i'm kind of like what i got this it's like shopping afresh like it's so exciting it's just literally like shopping afresh so um 
bought this dress and i think i don't really need a sequin dress but do i even have a sequin dress i don't think i have a full sequin dress so i got i found this sequin dress that is black and i just thought i need this in my closet just in case of emergency maybe there's a party somewhere who knows you know some of these things you can't know and it was that cheap and so i was like let me get it was 30 kind of shillings guys this was 30 bob and before i got it i had to check whether all the sequins are intact you know how sequins behave if one of the strings is out like the entire thing gets out they are all intact so that was a steal and then i got this green thing i like such by the guys i really really love such i had one that was white and i remember i wore it to death and i still have it in my closet but i used to wear it like almost all the time like a hoodie thingy it's like a shirt yeah this green thing is like a shirt but it's like a throw over shirt it's like a hood with drawstrings it has drawstrings on the hood part and it also has drawstrings at the bottom and a zip and like buttons here on the sleeves and like a huge zipper thingy here i really love such so that was a steal for me so let's just try on these clothes make sure you watch to the end because i'm trying them it's really long Okay, so the first thing that I actually got is this top. Okay, basically, I've talked about the top, so it looks like this. And uh, I really like it. It's frilly, it's girly. Just ignore the pants. They are really, really high-waisted. And the back just looks like this. It has a tie at the back. So you can basically see the tie at the back. There is the tie at the back. And it's covered like it's not open that's what i really like about it so i've just paired it with these high-waisted jeans like just to because i am not the kind of person to just walk around with my stomach outside but that's just how it looks and i really like it it's pretty yeah so you can pull it back so that it looks like an off shoulder you can also like just do this and then it looks chill and relaxed and it's just a nice versatile top that i really really like i like such tops they're so versatile they're so pretty like i just look at it makes you look expensive even without effort yeah so i like this one i like this one it's so pretty <laughs> anyway, we'll just have to understand it's a new wig. I have to, I look like the sun. Hmm. I look like hey, feeling hot, looking hot and comfortable and warm. So this is basically a steal. I know the sleeves are like really short, but I don't mind because I'm tall. Hey, I've never had sleeves sleeves that thick. So I really like this one. So pretty so comfortable it's so comfortable like i wish you guys could feel this fabric this fabric is fire you guys are gonna see me flipping this hair 101 times so just bear with me <laughs> bear with me so this is just the plain black top that i got as you can see it's a fitted top and i wanted a fitted top like a fitted one i didn't want a loose one so it just looks like this as i told you these pants are really really high waist <laughs> they're so high waist but it's just plain black top nothing to see nothing to see yeah so this is basically the tie and dye one really pretty really cute nothing much just fitted also like a t-shirt the material is just t-shirt material i like it i like it i like it i like it comfortable can be worn anytime any minute without looking weird and slutty so yeah this is my kind of thing this is the kind of thing that i like really pretty really simple even the colors are really flat flattering 
Snake. So nice. Okay, so I've basically just paired this massive t-shirt with this jeans coat just to hide the fact that it's huge. It's really, really huge. It's a size 22, guys. And I'm like a size... I don't even know whether it's a UK size or whatever, but I always have this jeans coat, so I just decided to pair it with this. And a pair of sneakers that just make it look like a fun, fun, fun outfit that you can go somewhere with. Plus the hair. Okay, this one honestly. <laughs> it's scandalous, guys. It's scandalous. Like, yeah, it is. <laughs> I'm not even going to turn, but you get the gist. But it's so comfortable, surprisingly. It's extremely, extremely comfortable. It's also extremely stretchy. Like, it's not the kind of thing that will limit your movements. But, yeah, you can get such a thing in the Mutumba. It's just that, where, where, where am I going with this? Where am I going with this? And if you're a relative, this is the point at which you log out of the video. <laughs> but it's a really nice thing. Quite see-through, but okay. It's cute, it's cute, it's cute. But yeah, without the hair, slightly more thin. Like, I can do something with it. Like, yeah, I know they're really light, so it's kind of makes somebody body conscious. But they're cute. It's striped. That's it. It's just striped. It has like this design at the front and the back. It just has a line, as you can see, going down the middle. But that's it. That is it. It's just a simple sweater dress. Nothing much. Nothing fancy. Flattering. This one yeah. basically is just giving me like tennis player vibes like where am i going with this am i 10 years old yes i know i'm the one who bought them but <laughs> like <laughs> this is kenya where am i going with this huh? but anyway maybe somewhere who knows who knows but it's really comfortable it's uh what is it called a collared top yeah sometimes when some clothes are being brought they should also take into consideration that some countries like Kenya are extremely conservative. I'm telling you, let me walk down the street in this. Nobody's going to harass me, definitely, but I'm going to be looked at like so, so much, like so much. But it's cute, it's nice, it's pretty. It's good for twerking. <laughs> what am I doing at this point? Sometimes it's just good to release stress. It's not like... Uh, you have to be all stiff all the yeah, time. Yeah, so for this one, I basically had to switch up the wig because of sequins. <laughs> you know how sequins go with synthetic wigs. Everyone will tell you, anyone who's ever worn sequins with a synthetic wig will tell you that it doesn't go well. It doesn't go well. Yeah, so I wore a short one at least. But the sequin dress is basically this one. Of course, I won't tie it with sneakers, but it's so fine. It's like it was made for me. Yeah, and as you can see, the sequins are all intact. So, do you normally say sequins or sequins or sequins? Oh, English is not our first language, so we should not waste our time on sequins. Yeah, so, but anyway, it's a really, really nice one. And I like it. I like this dress. It's so flattering, like, and comfy. It's not restrictive and stuff, yet it fits you well. So, for this one, we are looking at both the skirt and the top. So, this is the black lace top that i was talking about the one that had a v back so that's how the back looks and the skirt just looks like this pretty nice pretty decent pretty okay cute outfit that you can go somewhere with definitely i wouldn't pair this skirt with this top but i guess it can also go so it's nice nothing much yeah i have a pot but that's fine so this is the final thing guys the skirt I give it a 5 out of 10 because it's kind of tight, but it's still comfy and the top is also slouching. So I guess you can also wear it like this, but it's a cute thing. So thank you so much guys for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Ciao!